ton ami You're all I see When I close my eyes and dream You're all I see You're all I need, all I need So, we were back in France. Vive la France, Allez la Bleu, at the Revolution. We are in a, yeah, not too bad, well pitched out, spaced out air, in uh, Colmar. So, we're gonna relax, it's 30 bloody degrees, so it's way too warm for the dogs to do anything. So we're just gonna sit and wait for the evening and then take the 20 minute walk into, uh, the little Venice area, which is absolutely stunning. There's quite a few bears here. It's quite a good site. See the pitch is well laid out, so you get a good area. We got an end one, so we're lucky again. Lisa wants to be always in the blazing heat. Doggers are inside, the vents on, blowing the cool air for them. Um, yeah, we're just going to uh, take a little bit of time. It was a good drive up from Schwarzwald. It was absolutely gorgeous, actually. Some of the roads were insane. I'm hoping that I've got the uh, the dash cam footage well enough to uh, to put on the videos because it was a great drive. A lot of curling roads, left, right, snaking down, right the way through, and then up again the other side. Yeah, beautiful villages, lovely little towns. Germany was incredible, and we are going to nip back in there before we go home. Um, yeah, in the next few days. So we've got four nights now. Colmar, see you in a bit. Soaking up the sun, soaking in the sun cream. Bloody 30 degrees, belting. This thing's just pulled in. I can't even go and see it right now, but it, you wouldn't believe it. It's a big, well, it's a lorry, and it leads to a caravan on the back. Yeah, it's unbelievable. There's no way it's about. He's reversed onto that thing. That big red rubber bow truck has a caravan on the back of it. And it's uh, yeah, pulled onto a pitch. I suppose it's a motor caravan. There's a caravan on the back of a motor. Same thing, isn't it? Anyway, let's have a little look around. So what what this, uh, this air has to offer. Oh, bless you. When you pull up, auto uh, barrier, but you jump out, touch screen, choose English, gives you the language, so it's quite simple. Details in, registration, how many nights, how many people, pay by credit card, put your card in, put your number in, gives you two tickets and an exit code. So you tear the exit code off and keep that hidden. One ticket goes in your window, the other one you keep for your own records. And when you go to leave, 
Pressing the exit code, barrel opens, away you go. You get 24 hours. I think it was 14 euros 40, including the new um, tourist tax that I think came into effect in January. So this is the entrance, quite simple. It's the old flop blur system, which we've seen before. You've got the washing machines, which are good. Handy to have them right in front of you. These are the ones you usually see at like uh, petrol stations and bits and bobs along the way. 18 kilo wash, 18 kilo dry, 310, 5 euro, different cycles I guess. Tells you in uh, all the language that you need. Quite easy to use. You've got your bins here, your recycling centre. And yeah, lovely. Special disabled pitch here, which isn't on gravel, it's on solid tarmac. To make it easy, I guess, for wheelchair accessibility, etc. There's the truck. So, we go back outside and have a look. Like I say, it's quite simple to use. If you want to use the service point, which there's one inside, but at the moment it's not being used, you get jetons, which are tokens. So you go to the screen, ask for the tokens. I think it's one euro, two euro. So then you can use the service point. And the service point is outside. And again, if you're passing by, just want to service your vehicle, you still need to go to the machine, and get your tokens. That's the internal service point not being used. This is the external one, which is in use. Look at that. Basically, a caravan chassis on the back of a truck. Oh my good lord. From Germany. That is incredible. That really is an incredible piece of kit. So here's the service point. All straightforward, all easy to use, not a problem. Oh my good lord. Have you ever seen anything like it in your life? Oh, he's come out the harbour. From the marina and it's just there. I don't think you can get in there by foot. But you can get in there, obviously you have access like he has. Yeah. It's an absolute scorcher. Do you know how late it is? It's got to be. We didn't get here till nearly one. It's gone five o'clock. Anyway, yeah. There we go. Simple system, easy to use. Decent spaced out pitches. Separated by planks of wood or whatever. So everybody knows their place. Quiet location. A bit industrial around here. There's a Leclerc to the right, there's the marina. There's a couple of industrial buildings here. They're not really dirty, but we've not heard any noise. And this is a Monday. We've not heard any noise or been disturbed whatsoever. So, I would say, so far, this air at Colmar is, in July, worth the 14 euro. It's a 20 minute walk to the area that they call Little Venice, which is where we're going to go this evening. So, uh, yeah, I guess we'll see you uh, a bit later on as we're making our way towards the area of uh, Colmar in Annecy. Um, oh, Annecy. Colmar in Alsace, France. Let's so have a little walk on the canal. Aiming for Little Venice, which as you can tell by Lisa's reaction, <laughs> is just off in the distance. Oh, oh, she keeps going about Germany. Oh, what the half tubbered houses? Yeah, I love my half tubbered houses. I 
Anyway, it's been a while since we've been in France. We did all this last year, the Alsace region, but we didn't do Colmar. So we are here to see Little Italy, what it's all about, enjoy it, take in the vibe. And well, yeah, just just do the thing, yeah. Le Petit Venice, Little Venice. <laughs> it's so warm still, isn't it? Yeah, it's the restaurant of the free fish. There's a pub near us called the Three Fishes, but it's spelled F Y S H E S. Oh, look out! Very pretty, isn't it? Yeah, I feel like I'm back at home in Germany now. Oh, come on, back in Alsace last year, yeah, Gersheim and yeah, uh, Bergheim, yeah. Mittelberg, and they're all the same. Too, all the same, yeah, of course, it's just up the road. Oh, it's so much nicer when there's no one here. Padlocks, padlocks everywhere. Look at them. All declaring their love. Lock it in. It lasts forever. Did we have a padlock? <laughs> so, the little Venice, because the water runs through it. And everything's just set up with it, I guess. It's just my uneducated guess. What's a drink? Typical France, everyone shout. <laughs> I meant the dogs, don't you? Oh. <laughs> Oh wow. Wow. La Petit Venice. That is Stratford upon Avon, people. On France. Yeah, it totally is. It's uh, Stratford upon Avon in France. Just a bit warmer and a bit livelier. So, we 
kind of place, didn't we? We did. We did. We had a, a lovely nice, place. A nice cold beer. We've got a small beer. It's a coal mine. Oh, it's ah. the beer, beer of our sass. Do you want to get the picture, is it? That's okay, we're videoing. Yeah, you want to you wanna give a commentary on yeah. what we're drinking? What we're drinking right now? Huh? It's the beer de Alsace, yeah? Sorry? The beer de Alsace. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. It is um, Cressad in here. Perfect. It's cool. You are a good traveller, like a good tourist. Yes, everywhere, <laughs> always, every time, of course. Yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, anyway. So, the toy and trousers are saying cheers. Cheers. Okay. I can. Are you there, Anne? Uh, oh, on the phone to Anne. Oh, hello, Anne. Um, if you don't mind, we're just filming you a little bit because. Um, no, we're not filming just, them. I'm filming well, you. We're filming speaking your to friends. Them. We're filming us speaking to your friends. Bizarrely, we're just bumping to them in. Home for centre of the I earth. Universe. Yeah. Universe, universe, of course. Yeah. <laughs> this is about the fifth day before we go home now. We've been here almost three weeks, um, travelling Germany, the fairy tale road and the romantic road, and we've just popped into France now to make our way home. Bumped into your friends, lit it, sit in the little How bar. random is that? Um, and it's just absolutely amazing. They're a lovely, lovely couple and they're going, they're going to have an amazing adventure through uh, Spartans World tomorrow. On a motorbike? On a motorbike. Um, obviously, different, smaller vehicles than what we are uh, used to. Uh, yeah. Oh my god, I just can't believe I'm actually speaking to you. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Anne. 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 Hello,